Massive shout out to Blazing Boost for sponsoring today's video. Blazing Boost are a website that pretty much help you get the weapons, raids and flawlesses you guys need. So if you're struggling to do anything Destiny 2 content wise, this is a place to come. It has the best prices around. Not only that, it does have over 6,500 reviews and 97% of them are 5 stars. Now I wouldn't recommend a service I don't believe in. And trust me, this service is the best and definitely one you should try out. Even if you just don't have time to complete it yourself, then Blazing Boost is a perfect place to just get that extra help that you may need. Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today, I'm going to be showing you one of the fastest exotic, pretty much unlimited exotic farms. Now, I covered this over a year ago and it has come back recently. Now, I'm going to show you how to farm this the most efficient way. And this method is super good because anyone can do it without DLCs or anything like that. And you don't even have to be a high power to do this. Now I do have another sort of exotic farm. If you guys want me to show you that then I definitely will. But at the minute, this week for me, it is here the Bad Neighbours Adventure. Now if you guys have seen this in the past where I've done this, this method is insane and definitely one of the best. So I'm going to show you how to do it and obviously if you're new to the game... This is a great way to obviously get them exotics that you might be missing. But if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, drop a like down below and let's jump straight into it. So what you're going to want to do is simply follow exactly where I go on this video. Now we're going to be going to the end of the adventure. Now it doesn't take that long so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pretty much speed this process up so you guys don't get bored. So I'm just going to do this and then once we get to the bit where you guys need to see, I'll show you exactly what to do, what to kill, and obviously what not to kill. Right guys, so now that we have actually reached the end, this is going to be the final bit. Now, I'm going to explain how to do this. So you want to start, obviously, with this. Now, it can be a little confusing, but you are going to want to complete sort of a wave mode where there are a few hordes you have to take out. You have to shoot this, detonate that, and then it should start. But if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. It does really help out the channel. Not only that, follow me on all my social medias linked in the description. And we do also have a Discord, so if you guys are struggling to obviously do anything Destiny related, then check out the Discord for any help. But you want to kill all three of these wizards. Now, once you've killed all three, when the next one spawns, which is here, what's going to happen is there's going to be another wizard after this hive wave. And that is what we are going to farm over and over again. 
Now, I made this method, I think, either a year or a year and a half ago, and a lot of people made this same video. So I think I was one of the first people to actually make and find out this method. But yeah, because it is in rotation at the minute, if you guys log on and you don't see this adventure, try a different character. If not, wait till it becomes a heroic adventure. Now you need to kill these two here. And then once you've killed them two, what's going to happen is another wave. Now I'd recommend running something that's really easy to use, like a Xenophage or uh, anything that's going to kill a wizard pretty much instantly. So this is the one we're going to farm here. I think it's Azirax. And all we're going to do is simply kill this wizard and jump off the map. Now by doing this, what's going to happen is you're going to respawn, because it is respawning restricted, and you're going to respawn on that wizard, and you can simply farm this hours on end. And you'll get so many exotics and everything from this. Legendary shards, if you guys need anything. As you can tell, super easy method. Now, sometimes it will fall off the map, the wizard. If it does that, don't worry, because all engrams do go to the postmaster, if you've missed any. But yeah, if you farm this for a while, you'll definitely get an exotic. Now, I'm going to farm it for a little bit for the end of today's video. But like I said, if this method is new to you, check it out. Let me know how you get on. As you can tell, we've got a blue already. But you just simply want to do this over and over again. And pretty much try and do it as much as you can while it is on this adventure. Because it is the best method. That's going to wrap it up from me. As always, I will catch you in the next one.